My name is Dr. Zenas Yu, and I recently completed an NIHR doctoral research fellowship in dermatology at the University of Manchester. I'm the lead author on this study to develop and validate a risk prediction model for serious infection in psoriasis patients starting systemic therapy. So why did we do this study? Many doctors and patients have concerns over whether certain systemic and in particular biologic therapies for psoriasis are associated with an elevated risk of serious infection. There are no current tools to help patients estimate their own personal risk of serious infection available prior to starting a treatment. How did we do it? We used data from the British Association of Dermatologists Biologic Interventions Register, or BADBIR, to develop the prediction model. This is a national registry of patients with psoriasis in the United Kingdom and the Republic of Ireland that was set up to investigate the long-term safety of biologic therapies. Within BADBIR, we investigated whether a patient's baseline characteristics predicted the occurrence of a serious infection within one year of starting biologic therapy for psoriasis using a multivariable logistic regression model. We measured the performance of the model, or in other words, how well the model was able to accurately pick out the patients who suffered from a serious infection using the bad beer dataset. We then tested the model on a different group of patients with psoriasis using data from the German psoriasis registry called SOBES. What were our main findings? We had 10,033 patients in this dataset and 175 patients, or 1.7%, who developed a serious infection within one year of starting systemic treatment. We found that the baseline factors of being a female participant, increasing number of comorbid conditions, chronic obstructive pulmonary disease, increasing alcohol intake, being retired, and being treated with infliximab were associated with a higher risk of serious infection. The prediction model performed moderately in the bad beer dataset, but poorly in the external SOBAS dataset. So why is this study relevant to dermatologists and their patients treated with biologic therapies? Well, we found that baseline clinical patient characteristics partially accounted for the risk of serious infection on biologic therapies. A prediction model has the potential to help clinicians and patients choose the right starting therapy and thus facilitate discussions about lifestyle choices to modulate infection risk uh, while on biologic therapy. However, further development of the model is needed to include other predictive factors before such a model can be usefully applied in the clinic.